The following is a women's War Games match. The rules of the match are as follows. Two teams will be contained in separate cages with one member of each team starting the match. At regular intervals, alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match. The team with the advantage will be the first to have a member released into the match. Once all competitors have entered, War Games officially begins. The match can be won by pinfall or submission. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let the War Games begin! Introducing first, from Iowa, Key Anna James. You need to be ready for anything in WWE, but nobody is really ever ready for war games. When this match got signed, she didn't know her team would face the numbers game. She also didn't know she'd be in first and would have to face two competitors on her own. Well, we have seen her successful in WWE thus far, but this, this is the ultimate test. It's not a fair situation, but we all know all is fair in love and war games. What do you know about love? A thing or two. The pit bull has been released. No, get up. Oh, get up. The War Games match, definitely not for the squeamish. Two teams of superstars with license to truly do whatever they want to each other. As a fairly squeamish guy myself, this match always makes me uncomfortable, but it's a huge opportunity to make a moment or cement yourself as a star to watch. I hope someone here does that, and I hope nobody gets too hurt. Tension being used. The stop in the leg. Just nasty. She's got an answer for that. giving her opponent a moment to realize who she's in a fight with. And that was an efficient display of offense for that maneuver. Big boot on the mark. Hoist it up, hooking the leg. We've got a numbers advantage incoming as the countdown is about to run out. Uh -oh. I don't like this idea one bit. No good reason to be climbing here. Cage opens, and the strategy now has to be to take charge, play the numbers game to your advantage now. German suplex spiked. Come on now. Is it not enough that they're already coming in with an advantage here? 
Is this really necessary? And walking through the structure door, this is where nightmares become reality. Just provoking her opponent, daring her to make the first move. And Corey, here's the key to winning a War Games match. If your team has the numbers advantage, you have to use it. No holding back, no mercy. Absolutely. On the opposite end, if you're on the other team, then it's all about surviving the numbers advantage. Then retaliate once you've evened things up again. really has the potential to change the complexion of this ball. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Ball straight forearm. Slam it. Hurt. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Man, what a slam. A counter by Nile. Oh, a little submission move. Fujiwara. This will win the match, but it's doing a lot. Rolls through. Clever escape and a knee. Oh, put the brakes on Nile. Put her in position now. situation across the top rope and into the trench she goes this is not where she wants to be entering the ring and assessing the situation great counter impressive ring IQ on display there the strength of that slam that's probably not how she wanted to get from one ring to another. Looking wobbly in the corner. An agile escape. Up and... Pinpointing the leg in the corner. And here we go. Climbing up the cage. Only bad things happen from that decision. Sitting high above the ring, the only crap. No, 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 no. This one. Rolls through. Clever escape and a knee. Time is ticking away. Shortly we'll have a fresh competitor to even the odds. She gets launched all the way to the other way. Here we go. They look ready to get in there and even things up a little. Ooh. Oh, a shot right to the kidney. Oh. And again. Great way to wear down your opponent. No time for fear. Just get in there and engage with the enemy. Suplex brings them down. Oh, not today. Caught by surprise with the DDT.
gonna win the fall, but it's gonna do a lot of damage. Rolls through, clever escape and a knee. Uh oh, I don't like this idea one bit. No good reason to be climbing here. And she dodges that nicely. Straight to the face, stays off the attack.
said and done.